The 81.6 kilometer road is a federal road and a major arterial road linking four local government areas in Ogun State and Alimosha local government in Lagos State and has been a subject of discussion amongst those who ply it as a result of its deplorable condition. Residents here say the road has been abandoned for over 20 years with its attendant negative effects on socio-economic movement of goods and services and well-being of the people. It appears that soccer might have come as Governor Dakwa Biodun turned the sod and officially flagged off the reconstruction process with men and equipment mobilized to site. Today, we are celebrating you and we are thanking God for your life. Who has placed it in your heart that this road could not remain like this? Yes, it's a federal government road. Uh, they don't write it on anybody there that you are from Odun or from anywhere. You are sure what you have preceded us over the years and refused to do. To do. The State Commissioner for Works and Infrastructure, who is represented by the Permanent Secretary in the Ministry, explains that the road is divided into five sections for reconstruction, as the contractor seeks the support and understanding of host communities. The significance of this project, not just to Ugon and to the Lagos states, with the project terminating at the Abune Egg Park Bridge, but its economic significance to the trade and commerce of Nigeria as a whole cannot be overemphasized. What a feat that the goals and hearing of this project is actualized today. Addressing supporters, residents, traditional rulers, community leaders, members of the State House of Assembly, and those of the State Executive Council, Governor Dakwa Abiodun expresses gratitude to the federal government for giving the state approval for the reconstruction of the road. With speeches over, the governor leads other dignitaries to turn the sod and officially flagged off the road reconstruction. <laughs>